Alright, we are back. I've recently been on YouTube to find out where this particular ingredient that I'm meant to be finding is. And apparently it's on the floor somewhere. I think it's this thing here. There we go. Good lord, this is only the tutorial level. And I've already had to go on YouTube to find a certain object. Yeah, these will do just fine. Just fine. Alright now, we're going to be making something folks on the trail call healing powder. Go on over to that campfire now. Give it a try. Alright, uh, where's the that thing there, I guess? Uh, activate. Uh, healing powder. Except, there we go. Uh, one, I guess. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. Trudy, she's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. Alright, weren't we gonna like eat a meal or something? No? Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay, um... I guess... Uh, should I follow you? You're probably going a bit too slow. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna meet up with you later, I guess. Alright, uh, I should probably put my gun away, but I don't actually know what the controls are. Oh, something's nice. happening. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. What the hell is your problem? What? I, I, at least you just came in. Um, hello, I guess you're the person I'm meant to talk to. Come back. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. Thank you. Um, show me what you have for sale. Got a special discount for you, after what you've done for us. Oh, thanks. I, well, I have no idea what I've done for you, but anyway, thank you. Dirty water. It's selling dirty water. Lovely. Uh, meeting people? Oh, is that a magazine? Yeah, I guess that could be useful. Alright, accept. accept. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Thank you. Oh, by the way, I overheard your argument. What was that all about? Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Uh, why, where's Ringo now? He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Okay, well, I guess we'll just wait here until daylight. We'll just be ten we sleep. So we'll wait till the morning, so I don't know, about seven hours or so. There we go. Oh, look at that. The sun's the sun is out. Alright, so I think we're gonna go and help Ringo. So where did she say he was? In the gas station? I guess that's the gas station over there. Alright, so I guess he's hiding inside. I guess that makes sense. In we go. Hopefully you won't attack us when we come in. That's close enough. Who are you, and what do you want with me? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I am not an enemy, if that's what you're asking. Uh, or I could say, I'm just having a look around. If you're going to shoot, you better not miss. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. Yeah, sorry, got that's my bad. bad. I should have knocked. What say we start over with a friendly game of Caravan? You know how to play? Nope. It's a two-player game, and the winner takes the whole pie. You build a caravan using the cards in your deck. The goal is to create caravan bids that beat your opponent's bids. So there's more strategy than luck involved. So, you feel like playing a game? Um... <laughs> I mean, I don't really know the rules, and yeah, let's play. Uh, okay, so I'm betting probably all my money on a game I don't do not know how to play. Let's do it! Um, okay, what do I do now? Accept. Okay, I do not know how to play card games for my life. The only one I know how to play is Snap. Uh, oh god, I should have played a game that involved luck, not fucking skill. If you quit now, you'll forfeit the money. I don't know what to do. Ah, done it. I was meant to hit yes. Well, I guess I lost that one. Uh, press any button to continue. H. Okay, well now I'm poor. And I've got no money. Now he's going to bed. Uh, what time is it? It's not even... It's 7 in the morning. 
Oh, I guess, I don't know, maybe, I, maybe, okay, if I wait maybe an hour he might get up. Okay, yeah, there we go, he's got up again. Alright, let's talk to him quickly. What is it? Uh, did you know there's a man named Joe Cobb looking for you? Yeah, he doesn't look very tough though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I could handle all of them in a gunfight. Okay, um, what are you gonna do about the Pounder gangs? I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. <laughs> Alright, well good luck with that. <laughs> uh, you need a hide gun, I'm available. All I've got left on me are a handful of caps, but you get the, me the out caps of this that and I'll I make sure the Crimson Caravan pays you back. You've got my word. Hey, you'll have to do. Uh, what now? We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board... Uh, I'll ask her out, I guess. Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Ah, late. Let's go then. Let's go speak to Sunny Smiles. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Yeah, indeed. Um, I'm going to help Ringo take on the Powder Gangers. I might need your help. Say no more. I'm in. Oh wow, she was very quick. Uh, very easy to convince. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere, and Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. Okay, well, let's find Trudy. I don't even know who Trudy is. Are you Trudy? Nope, you are a settler. Uh, door to Godspring Home. I wonder who's in Godspring Home. Could that be Trudy? Okay, firstly, okay, I can wait. That's a good sign. Uh, there's no one here. I can sleep in the bed, though. Okay. Wow, this, this town really needs some work. <laughs> I mean, that house is, like, completely destroyed. Okay, I have no idea where Trudy's meant to be. <laughs> In fact, maybe there's a quest marker. I keep forgetting about those dirty great quest markers. Stock house. Okay, um, so this must be where all the people could be. Okay, so let's just, I don't know, let's just try to convince as many people as we can. How are you holding up? I'm good, thanks. Um, I'm hurt. I need help, Doc. Am I hurt? I don't know. The town is going to be attacked by bandits. Anything you can do to help? Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. Okay, he's giving me free staples. Alright, so that's that one done. Thanks, uh, Doc. You take care now. All right, let's go to the general store. You must be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Okay, um, uh, I need supplies to fight for the powder gangs. Tell me about the weapon mods, what makes it da 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 What do you know about the situation with the powder gangers? If Ringo doesn't head out on his own, I think we should hand him over. The town shouldn't get itself mixed into the problem. Don't mistake that for coward talk, though. We're a town of survivors. We'll fight tooth and nail if pushed, but we don't go looking for trouble. Uh, okay. Um, by the way, we need some supplies to fight the Powder Gangers. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the Powder Gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. Uh, Banter 25, let them take over the town then. I'm sure your business will be much better off. You made your point. I can provide people with some leather armor and extra ammo. Sure hope it's worth it. Howdy. Howdy. Um, I hear you got some dynamite. It would help us beat the powder gangers. Too dangerous. Gonna kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. How hard can it be? Just light them and throw. <laughs> Too dangerous. Sorry. Blow yourself up. Blow your neighbor up. Blow the whole town up. Alright, so I think we got everyone... 
everyone that we can. I really don't want to get any of these people killed though. Um, they're all so nice. So what's going on? Did Sunny agree to help us? Uh, Sunny's with us. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. Uh, uh, I think we've kind of done everything with that we can, really. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Yep. <laughs> Time to look alive. Oh, wow. The powder gangers are here to play. Well, already? Well, w wow. Okay, that was good timing, I guess. Um, okay, um, how many are there? At least six. Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. Okay, let's go then, I guess. I'll be set up near the store. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Alright, let's save the game quickly. Oh, she's sending her dog too. I really hope her dog doesn't die. It's fine. If the dog dies, I'll just reload the save. Okay, they, these NPCs clearly know what the sprint button is. Because <laughs> they're going a lot quicker than I am. Right, where are they? I'm just going to follow Sunny. Oh, wow, there's a whole load of them. Okay, I'm not taking cover whatsoever. Oh, that's one down. Right, they've got to drive with a bat. Very easy, I guess. Okay, I should really learn how to sneak and all that. Alright, that's that guy down. Uh, your weapon is in poor condition and can do more damage if repaired. It's fine, we're in the middle of a battle right now. Alright, that's that guy down, and this guy did. Alright, is that everyone? Is everyone still alive? Uh, oh, welcome to level 2. We made it to level 2, well, hey. Um, Okay, what what do we think? Um, okay, medicine. Medicine skill determines how many hit points you... Okay, that seems like a good one. Uh, Lockpick. Eh, guns. Guns determine your effect with any weapon. I guess that'll be good. See, if I do explosive, then we could have had that, but well, I don't know. Um, speech. I think speech would be quite good long term. So everything. All right. Um, oh, can we do more? Survival. That sounds like a good one. Do speech again. Oh wow, I've got like nine points to do. Alright, so let's put speech up right up. Sneak, do a bit of sneaking. Two more. One lockpick and one more gun. Alright, I think that will be good. The lockpick skill to do. Okay, how do I... Oh, pick one. Lady killer. Alright, that sounds like a fun one. Lady killer. <laughs> In combat, you do 10% damage against female. What? In combat, you do plus 10% damage against female opponents. Outside of combat, you would sometimes... You will sometimes have access to, to, to dialogue options when dealing with opposite sex. Well, hey, okay, let's do that one then. Alright, powder gangers. Uh, reputation. You have instrumented a reputation with a group of people in the wasteland. Whether that reputation is good or bad, you'll finally, finally somebody and people... Do, do, do. Okay, so basically the um, powder gunners don't particularly like me now, I guess. But the people in this town should like me, so yeah. Uh, good spring, though, they love me. I quite like how how you can gain reputation in, in this game. It, it does kind of make me want to like replay this again and then like try to join the dark side. You know, like actually try to get all the bad guys to like me. Um, but for now, we'll we'll play as a good good character. But we could like do maybe another uh, let's play. Uh, okay, the dog's still alive. That is good. Everyone seems to be still alive. I owe you a huge favor for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but. I know they'll understand once I explain things. Ah, oh, you're welcome. Uh, I didn't hear you say something earlier about not being able to pay me now. <laughs> uh, seems a little light for your work, I did. No, it's fine. I'll welcome. stick around for a bit longer, but I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan Camp. Alright then. Alright, man, well, I'm really enjoying this game. I I'm enjoying like the storyline and how there's all kinds of different factions. Factions like groups, gangs. I'm really loving this. Uh, where the hell is Sunny? Sunny better still be alive. Please don't say Sunny's dead. Oh, there's Sunny. Oh, thank God for that. That'll teach the powder gangs to avoid good springs in the future. Um, okay, well, goodbye. Until next time. Until next time. Alright, so I think I'm going to pause it here. I think this is a good place to pause the video. And we'll continue this in the next episode where, I don't know, I guess we'll go travelling. We'll go travelling to the next town upwards. Because I, I do want to go exploring, however much I like Good Spring. Um, wow, all these dead bodies. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, anyway, uh, till the next time, thanks for watching, and yeah, adios.